Welcome to PhoneSavvy.com smartphone training videos. On the Samsung Nexus, it is pre-installed with several applications that you can use. Each of these applications serve a specific function for your device. They are all labeled with what that function is at the bottom. There are several hundreds of thousands of applications on the Android market that you can download. The market is where you can go to do that. When you select the market application, it will take you into the Android marketplace and you can begin searching for apps that you can download. Since there are so many applications, they categorize the apps so that you can filter out any unwanted apps. At the top of your screen, there is a panel of different categories. If you slide your finger from right to left, it will show you the different categories of apps that you can search for. For example, right now we are on the top free category, which means we are now looking at the top free applications on the Android market. If you want to search for a specific application, the magnifying glass located here in the top right corner will allow you to type in the name of an app or a category of apps that you are looking for. If I were to type in phishing, it would load up applications that involve that category. Some of these are games, other of these are convenience applications for that category. When you find an application that you are interested in, simply touch the application and it will take you to a page with a description and some screenshots of this application. so you can see what it will look like on your phone. At the bottom you will see reviews from other Android users that have downloaded this application. So you can get a good idea if this is the type of application you want to download. If it is, select the download option in the top right corner and then select accept and download. the application will begin to download and install itself on your device. You can then choose to open this application from here or use this application at a later time. If we return to the home screen and we bring up our full list of applications, it will be listed in alphabetical order like the rest of the applications on your device and a new icon will be created and we can now use this application if you want to learn more about the Samsung Nexus visit phonesavvy.com